We are all fascinated by the power of the mind. And uh, listen, I know a lot of you out there are hopeful people, think that there's a lot of really powerful minds, and perhaps there are. Perhaps our next guest has one of those minds. He's a mentalist. Saw him bending the spoon. Do you believe he can really do that? Uh, well, the people in the room who don't know him, who saw him do that, say, he did that. They then, under their breath, went, oh, no, he didn't. <laughs> but he, oh, yeah, he did. Chaim Goldenberg is here. First is bio. have one of those moments where you wish you could read someone's mind? Let's give it a try. Well, Chaim Goldenberg says you have that power. Now, this guy claims to be a mentalist, not a psychic. He doesn't jive with the supernatural, but Switch. with a little intuition, some body language, and a whole lot of will, he says he can make things happen with his mind. So, what is Chaim's story? Well, it all started when he was growing up in Israel. When he was six years old, he was mesmerized by a man named Yuri Geller, a famous Israeli mystifier. So, the next day, and every day for the next two years, Chaim tried to bend a spoon with his mind. Did it work? Well, according to Chaim, it did. And he kept trying to master his skill set, reading minds, moving objects. He also knew how to please the masses. Now, by the age of 10, he was putting on magic shows and performing at birthday parties in his neighborhood. His specialty? Doves. Now, by the time he was 15 years old, he was done with magic and decided to focus full-time on mentalism. Now, after a mandatory three-year stint in the Israeli army, Chaim traveled the world perfecting his craft. Africa, Europe, the U.S., and a little country called Canada. In fact, he liked Toronto so much, Hello. he moved here five years ago. And now Chaim stars in his own TV series on TV Tropolis called Goldmine. Everybody, please welcome Chaim Goldenberg. Very, very good. Thanks. I will, um, I will say the same thing to you that I said to the amazing Kreskin when he was on the show. If okay. for some reason you are able to read minds, don't read mine because you'll find stuff in there that you. you don't want to find. <laughs> okay. okay. And if for some reason you do, sir, don't tell anybody. I may be, <laughs> I may be told me in advance because I... <laughs> yeah, you don't want that. Um, okay, what is a mentalist? Tell people. Uh, he's a person that uses abilities, uh, natural abili abilities, to create miracles, or cre create something that looks like supernatural abilities. But it's not supernatural? No, I don't believe in supernatural at all. You're skeptical about what... what I'm very skeptical, yes. Even though everything you will see in my show yeah. looks like real mind reading, re read, real uh, body language and, and all those things. Yeah. How did you just, just learn to do that? Can anybody learn to move, uh, to, to move a pair of glasses or, or bend a spoon? I believe so. Um, I started when I was six years old. I was very innocent and very weird boy. I saw Yuri Geller. <laughs> yeah, Yuri Geller is extremely famous, right? Yeah, and he's amazing. I saw him through TV and he told everybody, try to take a spoon, try to do it. Uh, and because I believed him, I took a spoon and I tried to bend it. And nothing happened. And the day after, I took a spoon in the morning, tried to bend it like this and like this and like this, and nothing happened. And every day, I continue and continue and continue. The difference between me and someone else is that I never stopped. I never quit. Okay, so let's, let's, let's do a couple things, because I think people want to see it. Uh, okay. First and foremost, off the top of the show, I drew something on a piece of paper. Now, that, that's not something that's 100%. You can't get that right. Do you know what I drew? Can you tell? Uh, I will try. It is okay. in your pocket. It's in my pocket. Okay. Do you want me to pull it out? Like uh, so? Yep. You can, yep. Okay, that's uh, my bank statement. You don't need that. I w again, I will try. <laughs> All right. So I drew something. I've, I've wrapped it up in several layers of paper. Are you like a Superman with tonight? Extra paper, that's okay? Uh, extra paper is okay. Okay. It's okay. All right. Uh, now, this is the thing. I, I want you to know this, Canada. I'm not going to bullshit you. If he gets it right, he'll be getting it right. He doesn't know what this is. Okay. Okay, and again, I will try. Yeah, yeah. Do you mind to hold my, my hand with your left hand? That's don't a great pickup line, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> hey, baby, hold my hand. <laughs> with the left hand. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Don't try to help me. Okay. I'm uh, gonna... <laughs> um, okay, okay. And just to f try to feel your uh, r resistance mostly. Yeah. And you don't help me at all. Right. I have something in my mind. I have something. Okay. You can all right. All right. Um, everything is straight lines, right? You use only straight lines. <laughs> <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> This is body language. This is tell me yes. <laughs> done, done. Yeah? You want me to show me first or? Dude, if you get this right, I'm taking you to the track. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Do I show you first? Please. Okay. You're lucky that I was mature. I almost drew this. Okay. Oh, for... <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> okay, now that's not a trick. It's not a trick. Do you believe in mind reading? Uh, I, I don't, I know, but I don't not believe in it. I, I don't know how it works, so I, I'm willing to say that anything's possible if it's energy, if we're Any, animals. Anything is possible. This is the thing. Anything is possible. You just need to believe and you can do everything. So we're going to do another trick. Now we need something for the audience for this one, right? Yeah, you need right. someone okay, for the Okay, so audience. here's what we do. I've got a baseball cap my old neighborhood Malton written on it. Here's what we're going to do to make it super random. I'm just going to hoof this into the audience and whoever grabs it, grabs it and they're going to come up and be your person. Anybody in particular you want? Anyone. Anyone? Anyone. Okay. Someone that's afraid from scary things. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Just random it out. Who was it? <laughs> Perfect. Okay. There you go. So, hi, how are you? George? Nice to meet you. Taliba. Taliba, nice to meet you. Taliba, Chaim. Hi. We don't know anybody, know each other, right? Neither of us have sleeves, so nothing's up them, right? Okay. So what do you want to do, Chaim? Hey, I will need my stuff. We're going to play a game, okay? Very dangerous game, so... <laughs> well done. <laughs> you should have let it hit the floor. Thank you. In the meanwhile, do you mind to mix the cube for me? Sure. It's a kind of a warm-up. Okay. Um, in this game, I'm going to fill your body language. There is four options. One, two, three, and four. You're not going to touch her, are you? <laughs> She's going to touch me. Okay, all right. <laughs> um, and a knife. This is why it's very dangerous. Uh, and please be careful. Please be careful. Oh, yeah, that's a knife, all right. It's a knife. And you, you can touch and feel everything. You oh, yeah, careful. that's a knife. Be careful. Uh, one, two, three, or four. I want you to choose where you put the knife. Do you have one? Don't tell me. Okay. It will be more impressive if you will not, if you will not tell me. Okay, then cha change your answer for the one change, yeah. change your answer. Did you change to this one? Yeah. 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 Body language. Body language. Okay. It's All not right. fair. I will not look at you, so I will, I'm going to cover my eyes. Okay. I'm going to cover my eyes. Okay. And after I cover my eyes, I want you to put the knife like this. This is just a sample. You don't have to put it here, but it's a good uh, one. And then you put cover, one of the covers. After you put the cover, you put another one here, here, and here. And you can your mind as many as you want. Okay? Hold it for me. And just for warm up, okay. you mix it very good. One, two, three, four, five, and see. I try to remember all the combinations. Okay. Yeah. Please do not touch the cube. How do you say mix or shuffle the cube? Shuffle. Shuffle. Every time I, I do the mistake. So you put a loony in there? Yeah, just to protect my eye when I take it off. Okay. Don't try this at home, please. <laughs> <laughs> only, only if your partner likes it. <laughs> Another one? Just help me. Yeah, okay, what are you looking for? More tape? Yeah, more tape. Can you hold it for me? Yep, got it. And can you take one more piece? Sure. And cover my eyes. Just be sure that I cannot see nothing. It's a very strong tape. Okay. Very strong. <laughs> Can you still breathe? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay, everything is covered. You can't see anything? I don't know. I, I know, I can see nothing. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. Well, if you flinch, then you can see. All right. Okay. Now, um, again, your name? Taliba. Taliba. Hold my hand, please, with your left hand. And I want you to put it on the ruby cube. Great. And Taliba, tell me which color you choose. Red. Red. If I remember correct, in this side, there is two reds. One in the middle, one in the corner. Yeah. And in this side, there is one red in the middle. Right. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay. I have 30 seconds to try to figure out and make the red color. And you have one, uh, half, half, sec half a minute to put the knife, put the covers, change your mind, and let me know when you're done. Okay? Please start. Two, three. Believe me, with my eyes open, it's much more difficult. <laughs> Four, <laughs> five, six, seven, eight. George, I'm, I'm okay? Uh, yeah, you're getting there. <laughs> Lord, this, Lord. Is, this is white, right? Correct. What are you doing? How do you do that? <laughs> just, just remember. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Now I go one in. Uh -huh. The red, I guess the red is, is this is a line of You're blue. absolutely right. Done? Dude, on my best day, I could never do that. <laughs> Done. <laughs> All right. That's incredible. Thank you. Hold my hand, please. Just hold my hand. Not too tight. Not too tight. <laughs> <laughs> 
thank you, but not now. <laughs> Taliba, I want you to look. There is one, two, three, and four bases with, with the cover. I want you to locate my hand on the top of number one, number one, on the right side. Just locate my hand on the top of number one. Let's go to number two, number three, number four. I said before it's a very dangerous game. Let's go to number two. Yeah, more feeling. I said it will be dangerous because I'm going to guess where the knife with my bare end, like this. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Next time I will let you know. <laughs> Again. You know why, why I was sure the knife is not there? Oh. Because this is what I told you to do, and you didn't do it for sure in the beginning. Let's do, do now the guessing game, the interesting. So, na so now you have less options, okay. Less options, but more options to get the knife through. So number one, please. Two. No, there's nothing to Let's go to three. It is you shaking or me? <laughs> I looks like you, huh? I'm so, you understand why. Let's go to number four. Leave my hand, please. Don't say, oh, if I don't get the knife through, please. It's making me confused. Number four. Yeah? No, number three, sorry. I'm a little bit confused. Uh, leave my hand, please. Number one. Thank you. This is one, this is four, uh, three. <sighs> By the way, don't worry, if the knife goes through my hand and you don't take it out, there is no blood. So, <laughs> I will go with my feeling, with my intuition. I'm sorry that I'm shaking, but you know, it's life. And <sighs> one, two, three. <laughs> Well done. Congratulations. Thanks. Well done. Okay, now I'm going to try it. Right. Now I'm gonna, now I'm gonna, all right, that's incredible. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, the show, you got to check it out that Heim's got. It's called Goldmine, TV Tropolis, Sunday nights at 6 and 9 p.m. Thanks for being here, man. Thank you so much. Bye -bye. Thank you.